హలో గైస్ వెల్కమ్ టు కేఎస్ఆర్ డేటా విజన్ సో హ్యాపీ న్యూ ఇయర్ ఫర్ ఆల్ ద పీపుల్ సో టుడే వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు డిస్కస్ అబౌట్ ద ఆన్ యర్ న్యూ వెబ్సైట్ అర్ ఆల్సర్ న్యూ న్యూ ఏఐ బేస్డ్ వెబ్సైట్ సో ఇన్ ద న్యూ ఇయర్ వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు డిస్కస్ అబౌట్ దిస్ టెక్నాలజీ మేబీ మోస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ద పీపుల్ ఆల్రెడీ హియర్ అబౌట్ దిస్ ఇట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ చాట్ జీపీటీ అండ్ ఓపెన్ ఏఐ so we will go with the one by one what is open ai and what is chat gpt both are same or else both are different and is this competitor for google is it true so all maximum uh, all these kind of questions i write down and we are going to deliver today so we will discuss uh, with this chat gpt as per my knowledge as of now we, uh, we what are the discussions we had with this so it will be useful for few people it may be harmful for a few people also it's a like a um, the technology is a like a sword we have on both sides and a sharpness right so similar way here also we need to check how it will be works what is a chat gpt and what is useful na how it will be useful in it industry so and for what reason they designed so lot many people already discussing about chat gpt they can able to write some codes also by using this is this true or not so we will uh, give all the information one by one today so before going to the actual topic please subscribe our channel if anyone watching this is first time and also uh, like and share our our videos thank you guys and uh, we'll go with the open ai so one by one we'll search in our google directly so what it is open ai just chat gpt particularly c h a t g p t it is chat gpt so it's coming like a open ai okay so we'll go to the login here you need to login guys so you need to create account if it is first time this is open a see here it is in a playground how it will work what kind of questions you are going to give so for example uh, in google you have some doubt and you are going to give in a google google will give answers in the list wise but chat gpt and this open ai will give direct answer so you know difference between you know right chat bot how chatbot will work actually if you are want to go to the one website and you want to check with their team members so there is a, a multiple chatbots is there even in a ksr website also we do have one small chatbot and whatsapp there one person directly interacting with you or else a few or uh, related questions already they will provide to and it is a kind of one and one interaction similar way chat uh, gpt also will work when you are giving one question it will give the direct answer but in google it will give multiple answer we'll go with in both ways we'll go to the google just mention here what is chat gpt and submit see chat gpt is an ai based power chat bot which is in nlp it is a natural lang- language processing and uh, respond in user queries uh, everything that information is providing here but in google we need to verify we need to open these multiple links and it is depends on uh, Uh, who are having the paid advertisements or else who are giving the best seo depends on that that list will come but here it will give the direct answer right guys so but chat gpt we are hearing now it will be helpful for to crack your interviews and test also few people are uh, saying like this but we'll see uh, today in the ksr and the recently our trainer given some assignments we will give these assignments it will be really helpful or not so how to create a series of a list in numpy and uh, direct and dict so we are going to give this answer to chat gpt we'll see how it will be works see it's giving complete answer including your code right so almost it's similar right thing maybe a little bit different but answer is true right so on the next question we will give a try guys don't try this one while completing your assignments but now we will check is this really competitor for google and what is users and what is losses uh, losses and uh, is really helpful or not and um, is this really competitor for google or not we will uh, verify here so google is giving all these kind of answers and but open ai or chat gpt will give direct answers but here also i am mentioning guys open ai and chat gpt we will go with the next step also is both are same or not also we will go the website looks like a similar the logo also looks like a similar and why they are promoting and everything we am going to give the information and uh, you guys you know um, this is a uh, microsoft also invested in this uh, our microsoft ceo like um, the satya nadella also invested and he made uh, some fun videos with the chat by using chat gpt so you can able to see uh, he was asking which is the best breakfast in you know, from the south india he was asking these kind of questions and it's giving the answers 
so maybe we can also uh, give the similar case and questions and us how to prepare biryani Or else how to prepare idli only that he was asking about the south indian dishes right we'll try with that answer question see it's giving entire answer how to prepare how many cups is required and everything is asking if you are asked the same question in google it won't give like that how to prepare idli see here first of all they are giving the nearby restaurants list so it's an a paid advertisement and later they are giving youtube links so who are making the best seo depends on that it will show but open ai it's giving complete information how to prepare for three two to three people it seems two cups idli rice salt everything they are providing here right guys check it here so a similar way we we are making with all kind of questions it will be able to give the answers and um, maybe people will think it's may uh, because of this technology it may loses jobs so uh, it's a little bit a serious discussion but we are going to discuss that one also if any new technology comes to the market uh, there is a chance few people will lose job but at the same way the market will create a new jobs no need to worry about because of the new technology maybe people will losing the jobs every day every time new technology will come new jobs will appear and the same way old uh, jobs will go like uh, maybe most of the people knows about the our trainer and when he was uh, explaining about the updating upgrading and updating he will give an a uh, question like when we have an uh, olden days around 10 to 15 years back uh, we need to shoot from the uh, air uh, air in the sense like uh, any play games or something so in a helicopter one guy will sit and he will shoot with a uh, bigger camera and he will take the entire video in the helicopter when drone come to the picture both pilot lost the job and the cameraman lost the job but at the same time uh, the drone developers who are makers of the drones who are able to fly the drones all those people got the new job at that same time who losing their jobs and another new jobs is come to the picture so we just need to upgrade as per the current market scenarios or current trends so it was not at all a problem for the techies uh, maybe there is a chance losing jobs and all don't worry about it it's not that like and another few people think if uh, artificial intelligence came to the picture maybe the human mind will go down and no need to think about it and code also simply we can write and our job will done easy something we are looking but when new technology comes it may help you to reduce your work burden not to uh, it's not at all equal to human mind so when you are thinking in the new way it will give the new questions and new answers everything and uh, we'll try with the chat gpt or open ai also today those kind of questions also example in our childhood uh, maybe our parents and all worrying about why you are using calculator around 80s kids guys so uh, even try our lecture teachers also saying if you use a calculator more your brain won't to have functioning something so really true uh, now we know need to use calculations or something but when come to the picture we used our the my brain in a different way we use in a different sources we no need to use a calculation we need, need to count the numbers and everything but the similar way we are using our technology our brain and in a different sources so don't worry about the new technology if it comes these kind of things your job will become easy that's it and we need to work on a little uh, other topics and other areas you can focus so here it's come right so now we will ask the other questions we will uh, play with the chat gpt open ai now so are you competitor for google or not we will ask that question for open ai only so i am writing this question for google so guys i am giving this question check it see it was saying we are not competitor for google and it is a chatbot powered by natural language processing technology that enables user to ask and review answer for their queries it's not at all competitor for google but google worrying about this and uh, our google ceo sundar pichai so he was planning to prepare a similar kind of uh, uh, website they are preparing and they are working on background and recently it uh, he also given the announcement on this okay this point also done and we'll go to the next one so we are hearing microsoft is invested in this is this true or not we will identify here we'll ask this question for chai open ai and is microsoft in stood in chat gpt 
see so now we got to know so yes microsoft is not invested in chat gpt they are saying right but we got to know earlier microsoft is invested or not we are we will ask this question again is microsoft invested in open ai open ai yeah see so microsoft is not invested in chat gpt but they invested in open ai so there is a difference between open ai and chat gpt both are working in the similar way so we will get to know the both the difference also reason when you are searching in google both are showing in that it's a similar way. like i am sharing my screen now you can check it guys go to the google open ai when you click on open ai open ai is a ai and everything they are mentioning right so click on like a chat gpt just search now as a chat gpt so now chat gpt is a chatbot launched by open ai they are saying chatbot is a subsidiary from the open ai but how is it true or else we are checking in it check it now is open ai and chatbot working together okay so i'm typing this question so they are working together but both are different companies we'll ask who developer open ai and who developer chatbots okay so you can see who developed this one in 2015 so under similar way chatbot who are founder for chatbot sorry it is chat gpt guys navin kumar and ajinj jain seems it's a chat gpt yeah but it given for chat gpt only i given for chatbot but it is given answer for chat gpt was founded in 2019 and it is developed by navin kumar and arjun raj jain so but uh, it should be give the answer for chat but but it given for chat gpt so the accuracy level you can check it how really it is accuracy so now we can go for again check it who is ceo who developed chat gpt so they given now arjun kumar and ara uh, Navin Kumar and Arun Rajan both are Indians guys so they developed the chat gpt and um, actually microsoft invested in these things also like we will ask those kind of questions also is really is invested or not it's invested in open ai or chat gpt also we will ask open ai is developed by whom and uh, who developed chat gpt huh? so where that question but they invested in open ai they are saying but chat gpt and open ai not working together we'll check other questions also so now uh, where it will be helpful uh, is this chat gpt will helpful for to writing a code or not we will ask this chat gpt only and uh, is chat gpt will help to write code in it industry see so they are saying uh, chat gpt is not designed to write some codes in it industry instead of that they developed this is a natural conversation experience to users with ai technology so and uh, same thing uh, chat bot and chat gpt so users need to uh, without any particularly person sitting and giving the answers and they developed maximum answers should be provided from the system itself so they developed to, to competitor for chat bot not for the google or else to create the entire questions but maximum it is working as a uh, giving the questions and answers everything right so the founders names again we will ask one more time they given the founders names uh, they already given the founders name and uh, we will ask the difference between open ai and chat gpt what is the open a and chat gpt
see you can check what is the difference between open ai and chat gpt so uh, what is the main uses of open ai and chat gpt we will ask them what is the an ai and chat gpt So we'll ask OpenAI and ChatGPT for same both are from same company or not? So it's giving differently. Both are not from the same company, right? So and both are different websites, but in Google it's showing both are same. And when you are typing as OpenAI, it is giving the chart bars. OpenAI, it is giving the website name. And when you are clicking on chart bar, uh, chart GPT. It is giving the similar kind of websites, right? We go for the it's giving open AI website link only again, but both are different guys. Okay, now so we need to check these websites uh, twice guys. Then we can get to know. And Chat GPT website is got crashed and it's not working now. And um, morning also I tried it's not getting. So once it's uh, settled and we will make a video number two second level. So how it will be works and how it will be helpful for in the future. So is really by using this we can write our code easily. So lot many people to learn these data science topics nowadays they are fearing. So but by using these kind of technologies and skills you can become a pro in data science. So but we need to use these in a proper way. So not to cheat in exams or something. We need to use this in a to improve your skill set guys. So in the part two video we are going to prepare, we will make in a separate video what is the difference between OpenAI and what is the difference between ChatGPT and how it will work both in simultaneously I am going to explain you. So uh, please stay tuned and please subscribe our channel to get a notification for your second video. Thank you guys.